Okay. Thank you. Enjoy, folks. Bye. Thanks. Right. Hello. Good morning. Hello. Good morning. Good morning. Oh, you got to take it all. Yeah. Superb. Yep, that's fine. I'll give you a guide there. Thank Shows you. you the map and the times inside. Thank Any you. questions, please? All right. We're not sending any of
So I'll give you a quick tour of the room that I'm staying in, starting from the entrance. On the left, we have the bathroom. We've got a nice shower here. And then obviously your toilet. And then a good, a good sized mirror as well. And this is see-through, which is kind of scandalous. And then we walk through, you have a queen size bed couch a really big tv and then you've got like your coffee making services and a fridge and some cups at the top which is nice let's see what kind of view they gave me and you can see a whole load of nothing but yeah, this is the room from another angle. A few moments later Yeah I'm not where I'm supposed to be And I say that shit openly I feel it It's strange Travel down the coast for free I'm going back there hopefully Where it's warmer Yeah, it's warmer mm -hmm. yeah. Check the front, I see a checker flag Too busy checking back, I always see a checker past And every check I spend is one that's meant to last It's funny how you own the car but rent the gas it's sunny days ahead, yeah, I was meant for that I got both feet in the door and I ain't stepping back I already wiped my shoes up on the welcome mat Yeah, the fans, they spend the cash, but they like, welcome back Yeah, welcome back And I don't really know who I am None of this is going to plan right But that's okay Think I'm finally on my way, yeah. 
finally done with breakfast and making my way back to the hotel. If you're ever in Manchester, I really recommend that place. It's called Ezra and Gil and their pumpkin on toast is so good. just got back from Manchester so I'm gonna do a quick haul of what I got from the Korean supermarket so I got some sesame oil because I recently ran out these are like rice crackers and they're really good and really low calories I got some dark soy sauce and then some light soy sauce. So in Korea, these are like really trendy. They're called like turtle chips in English and they're really hard to find here. So when I saw them, I just bought all three flavors. So this is a corn, corn flavor. Then you've got chocolate churros flavor. And then you've got indomie flavor, which is like a roasted uh, bean powder. Then I also got kimchi. It was two for one, so I'm gonna give one to my family when I go home. I also got these extracts. This one is bellflower and pear extract. And then this one is apple and beetroot extract. And apparently they're really good for your health. So I got two to try. Um, my friend in Korea sent me these before and they're really nice. They're like a uh, sweet potato, but the texture is just really nice and they're really good as like a quick snack. And then I also got, just the right way around, I also got some soft tofu to put in like soups and stuff. I also went to the Chinese supermarket a uh, Chinese supermarket, Chinese bakery. So I got this pineapple bun and this sausage bun. I or I got another. I got another. I got another pineapple bun, but I already ate that. But they're really good and really soft. So I'll put these in the freezer to eat later. And that's my Korean supermarket haul done. So I did buy a couple of bits and bobs from that store i think it's called sostrine greens sostren grand 
I probably butchered that name, but it's a Danish shop, so I tried my best. Everything was just so my style, like very simplistic, very pastel. I really wanted to buy it a lot more, but I have enough plates, so I only bought the stuff that I really, really liked. I got this mini whisk. I've been drinking matcha quite a bit, but it always gets really lumpy. So I thought that if I bought this, I can go, sort of try and get the lumps out. And this was only 62p, which I think is a bargain. I also got this like rustic looking plate. Like, I just really like the design and the irregularity of it. And I really like this kind of stone colour. This was, now how much was it? £3.84 <laughs> Then I also got this plate Like it's very simple I really like the green band around the edge And I just think it'll be really nice And photograph really well With like little cakes and stuff They also had this like Huge like pick and mix But for tea And this one really spoke to me I guess This one was called Irish Cream And I can't wait to see how it tastes I think it'll be really nice. Um, this is loose leaf tea, by the way, and it was only one pound twenty nine for a hundred grams, which is really cheap in my opinion. I also got this Madeleine mix. I bought a Madeleine pan about maybe seven months ago, but I've never had the the chance to use it. So I thought if I bought this, this will give me a chance to try it out. And I've heard that Madeleines are pretty hard to make, so I think it's best that you go with the mix. And yeah, this makes 30 Madeleines, which I think is like a bargain because it was only, what, £2.58? All of the prices at this shop were really weird. Like, they were, they were never whole numbers or like £2.50 or something. It's always like £2.58, £2.24 or something weird like that. But I'm not complaining. It's pretty cheap. And then I also got like this toothbrush because I forgot to pack one for when I went to the hotel. So yeah, that's my... Sostring Grens Hall, I guess. One thing I should add about this shop is that everything is hand finished. So that means every piece is unique, which I really like, especially for the price that they're offering everything. Mm -hmm.